Rising from the Zondo, Nugent and Mpati Commissions of Inquiry will be prioritized by the newly established Investigative Directorate within the NPA. This is according to the investigating, the investigating director, Hermani Cronier, who was officially introduced by prosecution's boss, Shamila Batoy. Cronier has vowed to send a strong message to officials that personally gained from rampant corruption within the state-owned enterprises, but did ask for patience whilst doing so. Rebuilding the integrity and restoring the credibility of the NPA, the prosecuting authority was compromised for almost a decade. NPA boss Shamila Batoy is working with the Hawks, police and other law enforcement agencies to make the institution more effective. The establishment of the directorate will immensely strengthen the capacity to address corruption. <coughs> However, I want to caution that complex cases take a while to investigate properly. And as you know, many cases have been neglected for many years. And we cannot fail with the cases that we bring to court. Advocate Patoy officially introduced Advocate Hemian Cronier. The new head of the investigating directorate in the Office of the National Director of Public Prosecution outlined the work that her unit would be focusing on. Our case selection criteria will ensure that we address those who planned, orchestrated and instigated the corruption of the system and those who ultimately derived the benefit of the looting of state coffers. Cronier says the investigative unit has three major priorities. These are fighting corruption in the criminal justice system, fighting corruption taking place at state-owned enterprises, and fighting high-profile cases of private corruption. Advocate Batoy also undertook to deal with the matter involving advocates Nomnobo Jiba and Lawrence Mkwebi once parliamentary processes into the matter are finalized. The NDPP says she expects the NPA under her leadership will face similar attacks to those the Scorpions faced during their existence. She reiterated that she has set up a team to tackle matters arising from the inquiry into state capture. Offense Estimo, SABC News, Pretoria.